On your idiots. idiots. We got to go political. We got to get we got to get a little Mavericky up in there. Okay? Oh Cuz I'm sick of this MILF on television <laughs> looking crazy, man. Governor Palin from Alaska. $150,000 on her outfits and her makeup. I guarantee you, Biggs, right. that next week when Halloween hits, uh-huh. there's going to be a lot of Palin costumes. Oh, she's going to cake off this situation, B. She's an opportunist. Yeah, she she's the celebrity. I mean, they're even making pornos with chicks that look like her now. <laughs> you saw it? That's yep. none of your business. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody wants the MILF. She can't fool us. Can, could this chick really run the country if something happens to Grandpa McCain? Hell no. I mean, that's what you got to think about. And, that, and that's what General Powell said when he endorsed Obama. That's the same thing he said, man. Come on. She couldn't even explain what the duties of the job that she's basically applying for were. No. And it's very limited. She doesn't know. She's like, well, we preside over. Shut up. They didn't prep you on that, did they? But they prepped your outfits, didn't they? Mm -hmm. Uh Uh-huh. I wouldn't be surprised if she runs for president in 2012 and and she got a boob job or something. (laughs) I wouldn't be surprised. If something happens, and we don't want anything to happen, but if something happens to Grandpa McCain, (laughs) <laughs> the MILF could get in <laughs> So you have to really ask yourself Can the MILF run the country yeah. And and I, I'm not sure I'm comfortable With the MILF at the head no Pause <laughs> <laughs> No pause No pause at all <laughs> On here idiots Are you comfortable with the MILF running the country She don't even know what her duties are To even run the country Right She don't know what she's doing no, the little girl from Alaska needs to stay in Alaska, raise her kids, and keep it pushing just like that. It's an Obama's world, and she's just going to have to live, live in it. On here, idiots, are you comfortable with the MILF running the country? Hell no, nah, man. Yo, I don't know why nobody bringing this up, man, but don't they look like uh, Miss Flanders and the dude from The Simpsons, man? What's his name? Uh... Mr. Burns. I, I, I see I see Grandpa McCain more as the Crypt Keeper than, than Mr. Burns. Man, he... On here, idiots, are you comfortable with the MILF run in the country? No, I'm not. Why is that? And it looks like her husband's just along for the ride, bro. It looks like he's going to watch TV in the White House, you know? Yeah, he's the first. He could be the first dude. <laughs> he's, that's what he looks like, man, but she's not ready to run anything. She's ditzy. Yeah, she is, man. She is. But like, I work for the fire department. Everybody at work likes her, man. They love her. She's a little superstar. Everyone wants to her. And, uh, you know... Guys want to be with her, and that's bringing Grandpa McCain more votes. On here, idiots, are you comfortable with the MILF running the country? Well, first of all, I want to say that I don't like that we're calling her a MILF because that sexualizes her, and we're not sexualizing Obama or McCain, so I don't like that from a female's point of view. That said, I don't like her. I'm not for the drill for Alaska, and how can you be for a woman who's against women's rights, yo? Any woman who's not pro-choice is not cool with me. That's a good point right there. But go, going back to what you said about the sexual thing, I mean, all these dudes want her, so that makes her a MILF. Nah, it doesn't matter. If they... And that's pretty much part of her popularity. Yes. That's what she has to say and how she feels about certain platforms. Ah, uh, uh, whatever. No, no stop. When, when Hillary was running, ain't, ain't nobody was calling her a MILF, right? <laughs> Bill doesn't even call her a MILF. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, damn. On here, idiots, are you comfortable with the MILF running the country? Yeah, definitely, but, I mean, I'm not Republican, but it's to the, this is to that lady that said calling her a MILF is a bad thing or something like that. It, isn't that more of, like, a compliment? Pretty much. But, so, like, I don't see why complimenting some lady about how sexy she is or something like that be a bad thing to do. Uh, what can you do is a lot of those. On here, idiots, are you comfortable with the MILF running the country? See, this is Jose the Plumber. Joe the plumber does not have his license, but I will go over there and clean those pipes. And my cousin Ricky, too, man, the carpenter. We're going to nail that hole. <laughs> <laughs> On here, idiots, are you comfortable with the MILF run in the country? Absolutely not. We need to change. In the words of the great Tupac, we need to change the way we eat, the way we live, and the way we treat each other. Let's vote for change. Vote for Obama. All right, that's what's up.
On here, idiots. Are you comfortable with the MILF running the country? You should not run the country. It should be a man. It takes a man to run the country. Wow. Wow, you're not married, are you? <laughs> no, I'm engaged. Yeah? Does she know your feelings? <laughs> yeah. Don't always work out, though. <laughs> Let me guess. She does all the cooking and cleaning. Oh, yeah. Yup. Right. <laughs> she has good aim. I heard she can shoot. Yeah, oh, that's another thing. She What does she kill, wolves? Uh, She's a hunter? Yeah. <laughs> and, and this is a topic for another day, but how the hell are you against abortion but you go kill a wolf? And when she kill, no, she kills like when she kill like deer or m- moose hunting. She does moose hunting. Moose hunt, whatever. It breathes. It walks. It's a living thing. Freaking humans. Let me tell you, one hundred and fifty thousand dollars on her wardrobe and makeup and all that. Terrible. Wow. Imagine if she was president, she'd be living like Jabba the Hutt, man. Wow. On here, idiots. Are you comfortable with the milf running the country? Only thing she can run is her lips on my boss. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, man. Come on, man. Alaska? Jody Rowell would do a better job than her, man. Wow. Come on, wow. man. And she sure as hell ain't no MILF. Nah. <laughs> there goes my tax breaks. Now, one of them is a MILF. Come on, K-Dub. You wouldn't touch that, man, would you? Jody Rowell? No, no, I'm talking about Sarah Palin. You, I have to take a couple shots of Patron to the head and a couple L's, man. I mean, I would just so I could come back and be like, yo, guess what happened, B, you know? <laughs> That's it, but, you know. That's one of the ones you'll be trying to get over real, real fast. She, She's a little light-skinned for me, you know? <laughs> On here, idiots, are you comfortable with the MILF running the country? Hell no, tell that b- to stay in the dark. <laughs> Right? Right. On here, idiots, are you comfortable with the mill front in the country? You know what? It doesn't matter because once they get in office, they don't do a damn thing for us. Is How old are you guys? Because where have you been? The Every president that has run, he's been in his 50s or 60s running. The reason why McCain looked like a grandpa is because he was a prisoner of war. He's all broken up. and Yeah, but he's 72 years old. Yeah, but you see his wife? His wife is gorgeous. Uh, uh, she's not running, though. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it, it doesn't really matter because these presidents don't do nothing for us. They're not going to listen to us. They could promise us anything, and they're not going to do a damn thing because they got to go and talk to somebody themselves. Yeah, the Illuminati. Shh. Another topic for another day. Woo! On here, idiots. On here, idiots. On here, idiots. 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 Idiots.